Welcome to MC Podcast, aka Men of Culture Podcast. And in this video, I'm talking about Chain Soldier Episode 8. This episode was immaculate, great. I told you, I told y'all, if y'all watch that video, I put out Episode 7 of Chain Soldier. I said that best girl Tenka about to be best girl of the season. And what she do? Be best girl of the season. Now, the episode starts off with Tenka basically saying, yeah, Yuki... I like him, I want him, and that's what she said, she basically said, she laid it out to Kyoka, like, yeah, I'm fucking with him, I'm feeling him heavy, so I want him, and Kyoka's like, well, it's not really, a, it's not up to me, as long as it's not during work, it's, it's, it's a personal thing, in your personal life, it's fine, Kyoka wasted no time, saw that, saw that nigga y- uh, Yuki immediately, basically immediately after they leave, and I'm not gonna lie, Hands the hands the invitation out. Look, I want you. Let's let's make it happen. My boy Yuki was befuddled, and honestly, understandably so. She just kind of just like came out of nowhere, and just like, just, yeah, I like you. I like the way you just do things. I just like you. And, and, and you know, Tenka, she a she a big booty baddie. There's no way possible. You can just say no, but she she basically gives gives him the option. No, you can think about this, or we could just get it on right now. And my boy was really looked like he was really about to get some. He was really about to get some. If it was me, I wouldn't be thinking with my head. I'd be thinking with my other head. So it would have been it would have been no questions for me. Was, you say you say nothing but a word. I'd have been like yeah, right away, definitely for sure. Uh, it was a really great scene, honestly too. Uh, the way they they animated it. Uh, the way how alluring Tenka was and how the offer sounded too like you, you it was like you'd be an idiot if you said no. It was just such a great and a well animated moment in the anime. Solidifier for me, best girl of the season already. I don't need to need to watch any other uh winter animes. Best girl Tenka, I already said it. Uh and, but unfortunately before some things were about to happen, because Tenka was getting real touchy. She was feeling up on my boy, and, and it looked like Yuki was about to, about to fold soon. He was trying to hold back, but it like he was about to fold. And then Susha comes and fucking wants to be a cock block and, and basically stops my nigga. So after that, basically Kyoka's kind of getting in her feelings. She really, she really not really liking that fact that, like, you know, Tanka really all, all over him, and Yuki kind of feeling it. I mean, he's not blatantly showing it, but you know, he's a guy, you know what I mean? What guy wouldn't be if a beautiful girl was feeling you? What, what, you know, you don't feel you don't feel them a little bit. Uh, Kyoka's a little bit jealous, but the episode continues. Uh, the most important part of the episode, probably for like storyline and plot wise, was how Yuki's ability works. Basically, um, the way Yuki's ability works is that whoever touches the chain, depending on their uh, natural ability that they have or in their attributes. And characteristics they do uh it does change his um the abilities that he's allowed to use from his like shoe guy form whatever the fuck you want to call it or it's yeah i'll call it shoe guy form so we see with the uh little girl i forgot what her name was he could see really really far away he could see, he has really good sound and perception uh so you can see so well that you can see through people's clothing which i'm not gonna lie Loki would be a great ability to have. Turn it off and on might be a great ability. So he's able to see through people's clothing. Um, with Susha, he's just super strong. Um, and that was pretty much it for that portion of the episode. Then, um, as things go on, Tenka's flirting OD with Yuki, and it's it's, it's getting on Kyoka's nerves. She's definitely starting to show clear signs of being jealous. They get an emergency alert that they have to go fight a bunch of shoe guys. They go out there, and Kyoka basically was like, yo, I'm not, I don't fuck with this shit no more. Basically, she was saying, you need to stop messing with Tenka. So, you're my slave. You're mine. Basically, she was basically, you know, she was jealous. And so they fight, and we do see one of the antagonists of the se- of the series kind of just fucking with them. Not really attacking them, but having the shoe guy come out just to fuck with them, just to see how things go, 
that's pretty much the end of the episode. We didn't really get to see um, the reward that he would get. But it was a great episode. I really enjoyed it. I really, really loved this episode. The way it was animated, everything about this show so far is just getting better and better every time. Chain Soldier Episode 8 was a 10 out of 10 fucking episode. That was a great-ass episode. MC Podcast signing out. Stay Metal Coach, my peoples. Peace.